Hello everybody, welcome back to the next stream. Um, this one I'm going to do something a little bit different. I'm actually going to use some mods to respec some of these companions a little bit. Um, not, not anything too drastic. Um, I sort of want to keep the, the vibe of them whole but I, I just want to make some adjustments it's my uh, optimization brain ticking away I'm, I'm not necessarily going to make them super optimized but I do want to improve them a little bit um, so we'll just bring up the uh, I'm not going to touch Camellia um, partially because she, she's got like the undetectable she's a bit mysterious at the moment and I'm worried that actually getting to modify her will spoil something somehow so I'm gonna leave her alone she's really just mostly doing her hex thing now anyway which is is fine um, but I do want to do Sila and Lan uh, so I'll actually start uh, I might shut that down uh, I'll start with Sila now Sila. I think I have. To, I think that's the setting I need to use, because I want to keep the portraits and everything. I, I I did do some playing around with this, and like if I do that one, I've got to pick a whole new portrait and everything, and I I couldn't really find one that I I liked. So, uh, all right, <coughs> let's do this. Okay, so she's staying a paladin. Plain Paladin, nothing different there. She was a pickpocket as her background. I'll keep that. Ah, uh, no, that didn't quite work out. Oh, I've got to hit keep original stats. Sorry. Original stats. That's right. Yep, cool. Uh, Paladin... Alright, uh, street urchin pickpocket. Alright, now this is where I'm going to play around a little bit, and this is going to, um, it, it's, it's a little, the, the way it works on this isn't quite right, but we'll just go with it. Like, I need to, I'm, I'm basically going to make a two weapon fight with the sword and board, so I'm going to stick with the sword and board, um, I'm going to reduce that wisdom down because that seems I mean she literally calls herself woodhead so that the high wisdom just did not seem appropriate anyway to be honest um, make that I don't know that doesn't really matter that much anyway but she's a little beefier overall like this doesn't conform to point by stuff um, anyway that's fine uh, skills, her skills are a little weird, I'm thinking that, that, and that, I, I don't know if I'm ever going to, like, use her persuasion at all, but we'll roll with it for now. Uh, now, I want, uh, I actually want two weapon fighting. And, and then I'll get shield bash as the next one. Uh probably quicker just to scroll down where are you shield bash so this now allows her to whack with the shield and hit with the sword um, and be a bit more offensive um, with the sword and boarding but basically she just had all these defensive things um, which you know doesn't doesn't help me smite the evil okay Alright, another paladin level. Go the same skills. Pretty simple there. Now what's... Weapon focus. I could go weapon focus longsword. Could go double slice. Could go power attack. Uh... Might for now. Hmm. 
Mm. Well, that's a difference of two damage right now. <coughs> so is power attack. Um, at a cost of... So technically speaking, that's... Currently, well, only on that weapon though. Power attack applies to all attacks. Let's just look at these prerequisites. No, I, I mean, it would be longsword. Here we go. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, I might just go with that. All right. But you just get divine health. Uh, immune to disease, divine grace. Just get the charisma bonus to saving throws. Very nice. All right. So hopefully she'll be a little more offensive now. Uh, it does reduce her armor class a little bit because I, I now don't have dodge and all that stuff. Uh, I also need to change her weapon loadout. Uh, no, I don't want that. Let's use let's use radiance. I mean, I feel like that's sort of in the game to 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 be her weapon holy shit where did i get all that oh okay uh all right and a heavy shield so the heavy shield does not seem to yeah it's just the two weapon fighting okay so it doesn't seem to i'm not sure like i, I thought normally you had to use a light shield um anyway I, I might grab a light shield if I see one at some point, and uh, we'll test that out. Um, it might not be implemented properly. All right, now LAN. Let's do LAN. Uh, all right, uh, he's also Aomidae, I think. Now, where is he? He's a Zen Archer monk, so we'll keep with that. Uh, he's a hunter. I think I'm pretty sure <coughs> all right so this is where he annoys me so I'm gonna take that strength down a bit I'll take that up to 18 that up to 18 uh, I want to switch that around and then that I guess yeah that looks fine again probably a little bit definitely a lot more points than it would have been otherwise I uh, still want to do the athletics and mobility and perception that he had before. I think that's a pretty good mix. Mainly because he's never going to wear armor, so he's never going to get that armor penalty to um, athletics and acrobatics. So, um, yeah. Uh, I'll get point blank shots. And I'll get rapid shots. Uh, he, he follows Ioma Day. Cool. Uh, Zen Archer again, same deal, get precise shots, wave a longbow, and again, alright, uh, deadly aim, let's get that as well, and point blank master longbow. All right, cool, cool, cool. Yep. So he's now having rapid shot and deadly aim. Gets him plus six. I can switch off deadly aim if I have to. Um, but he's now doing pretty decent damage. I'm not just. No, I'll have to wait till combat to try that out. Um, 
Oh yeah, it's plus two from deadly aim and plus two from composite bow. Okay. Uh, I also want to try. Um, just, I, I just kind of feel like making a. Oh um, uh, yeah. Okay. I might, oh, sorry, I'm clicking on the wrong screen here. Uh, so, Sealer's Armor. I might actually switch that out. I'll go and sell all this shit to the, uh, not, where is he? Here he is. Show me what you have, buddy. Alright, so I'll keep that, I'll keep that. Yeah, I don't need all those. I don't need all those. Don't need all those. Probably keep a couple of those just in case. I uh, definitely don't need those. I don't even know where these came from. But whatever. Uh, I've still got that. Still, I'm not sure who to give that to just yet. Alright, I haven't got any other random crap. I've got Hugh Head Chomper. Uh, perception and law nature so I, I might actually put that on my main character um, cool and I actually want to get yeah just a regular breastplate for Sila now that she's higher um, dex so that we can get that um, higher dex bonus into play since we have to have it for the two weapon fighting um, I had thought it was only 13 but it's, it's actually 15 which is pretty high alright let's go and I'm just going to try and get a couple of mercenaries I, I just really feel like building something um yeah, sure, why not? Alright, this all I, I did also get some uh, portrait mods too, so this will allow me to use some of them. So, first, I want to do is some sort of half orc marshal to use that pole arm for now. Um, no, not a dwarf. When, where's some, where's my sweet, sweet half orc boys? Oh, that guy's pretty badass, though. You wouldn't know if he's a half orc or not. I'll have a look. I might come back to him. Here we go. Here's my boys. Yeah. That one's pretty cool. I want one with a big fuck off pole arm and a bit more heavily armoured alright don't not a fan of any of them in particular what do we got here rock man fucking Tiefling Fabio. Okay, well, I might go back up to that really armored dude. Um, because he looked, he actually looked like he was wielding a pole arm as well, which, yeah, all the, um, half orc ones had friggin' other sort of double handers. That dude looks like he's taking a dump. What is what's this one? Okay. No, let's go with this for our uh power man now. I there's a few choices here. I could go barbarian invulnerable rager. Could go blood rager, that'd be interesting. Because uh, they get charisma as well, so yeah. That, that, that's a possibility. Cavalier Disciple of the Pike. 
Oh. Oh, that's interesting. Pike charge. Okay. Oh, that's cool. Because you, you do end up charging quite a lot. Uh, it's, it's got to be spears, though. Yeah, that's a bit of a bummer. Hmm. Yeah, probably not. Uh, fighter. I actually get. Okay. Will says. Armor training. Will says. Yeah. Uh, Two-handed fighter. What do they get? Strong grip. Nectar against disarm. Yeah. It's kind of bravery overhand chop yeah it's losing armor training's a bit of a bummer this is weapon training backswing Okay, so he's now getting the extra damage. Wow, he just hits like a fucking truck. Pot, what the fuck is that? Single melee attack. Attack hits, makes a bull rush or trip. Free action. Hmm. Hmm, yeah, it's pretty good, but I like, could just go regular fighter. Like, there's no actual need to feel like that's a lot more versatile. Um, Hunter, no, because no. I, I mean, I really need a, a full BAB for this. Ranger? I mean, I could do Ranger combat style. Is there a polearm version of that? I mean, I can always respect this guy too, so I might try out a few different builds here. Yeah, Ranger... Ranger Demon Slayer, maybe. That would be pretty cool. Uh, Skull full BAB? Because the idea I've got here is like that, that, um, Glaive has that, uh, fucking fear power. I'm thinking of, you know, making a dude who's sort of a, uh, um, if I can get my brain to work. Intimidation build, uh, Cornagon Smash, all that sort of stuff. I could just go straight up Slayer. Slayer is always just fucking batshit crazy. Anything you need, they can do. War Priest? I do want to make a War Priest at some... I want to try and make a Shield Shield War Priest. Um... Okay. Blood Rage. Uh. What are these? Bard of Knowledge. Why is that removed, but then not removed? Oh, it's only for Knowledge World. Okay. Battle Prowess. Oh, I can get Teamwork Feats instead of Rage Powers. Oh, that's pretty fucking cool. Because from memory, a lot of the Skull powers get a little bit... Um, not quite as good. 
Uh, Urban Scald is, is really good. If, if there was Urban Scald, I would almost definitely go for that. Demon Dancer. No, I'm not going to Demon Worshipper, man. That's... That's fucking terrible. Yeah, no. Nah. Um... Yeah, I'm actually thinking, uh... This battle sign would be pretty cool. Lawmaster. Yeah, okay. Raging Song. DR, Dirge of Doom. Song of the Fallen. Ooh. I mean, I say ooh, but it's not actually that great. Uh... Yeah, I'm I'm going to try it with this Ranger Demon Slayer first. Let's just go with that. Let's see what what we get out of that. Half Orc. Uh, I want to be tribal. Um that doesn't Wangian Hunter, Mandavian Orphan. Saving throws against demons. That would be pretty good in this. Yeah, let's just do that. Oh, look at me. I'm an orphan. Oh, uh, what? I'm not... Why am I not getting points? Oh, the respect mod must do that. Alright, so I'll... I'll just leave that for now. You're gonna be a strength dude, so I'll have to come back in and respect that out. That's fine. That's fine. Um, perception. I just get a lot of class skills. Um, athletics, raw nature. Sure, let's just do that. Whatever. Oh, did I get athletics? I did. Okay, because yeah, he might also end up being a, a trip trip man. Um, now, power attack is just what what he needs. Why can he not get power attack? Maybe it's up the top and I missed it. Weapon focus. Oh, because he hasn't actually got enough strength. Because <laughs> i got no stat points. <laughs> Alright, let's just go initiative for now. I'm going to respec this guy anyway. Um, Alright, who do we want him to follow? Um, yeah, let's just go Saren Ray. Neutral good. That's that's my jam. Um, oh, I was gonna make this a dude. There we go. There we go. Uh, I'm not I'm not too worried about any of that. Uh, can I get him bluish skin or something? Meh, that'll do. Whatever. Uh, hairstyle. Uh, don't show the headgear. Yeah, let's get some dreadies. That'll do. Bit of wall paint. Purple wall paint. There we go. And my traditional color scheme of purple and green yeah, he's already got a green I'll just go with that green I can take you for this. yeah that'll do and he can be Kajal Ooh. 
I'll take care of it. Demons of magic, demons of strength, demons of slaughter. Well, he gets a lot of fucking favored enemies straight away. All right, complete him now. Okay, so now I'm just gonna fucking respect him straight away. Um, Kajal. Oh, that's how you do it. Okay, so I put 25 in there and hit that. Okay. Cool. Uh, oh man, now I've got to do all this again. Uh,. There he is. Class. So I went Ranga. Demon Slayer. Oh, I wonder if I actually get the combat style with that. I didn't check that. That's sort of partially the point. I, I really like the range of combat styles. Um, None of those get it. Three clubs, close to those stays. Hand axes, battle axes, great axes, fortitude saving throws. Light hammers and war hammers. Courtier, rapiers and bucklers. Rapiers, long sword, great swords, bucklers. No. Oblate. Ah, uh, there is really some really cool stuff. Um, can use wisdom for charisma. Yeah, for persuasion. So that's actually a, a pretty cool option for um, um, your main character, I think. Um, I may have said that during the initial thing. What's this do we get? Do any of these get like polearm proficiency, scimitars against trips? Shackles call set. Oh, right. Uh, attacks of opportunity. Uh, da -da -da -da. Nah, no. Nah. Uh, scholar. No, nah, scholars aren't going to get that sort of shit. Trickery and nobility. Trickery and persuasion. And Nishbone. Nishbone's not bad. Uh, hermit hit points it's not terrible uh, I don't know I think I'll just go with what I went last time which is the Mendevian orphan that's fine here we go alright now strength strength's going straight up to 19 I need some con. I'll definitely need three because I, I don't want to get uh, combat reflexes with this build. Uh, and I want to try and get some of that. I mean, this guy's just a straight fighter, so if I, yeah, you know, taking a point of. If he's not as skilled, I'm not. I'm, I don't even know if I'm actually going to use this guy, honestly. Um, I just kind of want to build him. Uh. Alright, so I'll get four skill points, so I'll get athletics because I might want to trip, I'll get persuasion for intimidate, and I don't know, that'll do. Oh, that's a minus one. Yeah, stuff that. I'll get law nature. Yeah, cool. Uh alright. So now I want power attack. Go. Sorry, one male half all, please. Power attack. Okay. Torag. 
go sideways. All right. Uh, piss the headgear off. On them dreads. There we go. Oh, actually. Yeah, let's get a beard too. Why not? Oh, damn. That is very suave. I was thinking more just, you know, a regular. These are all too groomed. I was thinking just give me a fucking shaggy beard, mate. A mo. I don't want a fucking Fu Manchu. Uh. uh wall paint. That one. I like that one. All right, there we go. We do it my way. Hmm. Look here, you crook. Let us find our path. I'll go ahead. Short nose, beautiful. I need to concentrate. Yeah, that'll do. Kajal. I will guide. Now, this is going to be the key one because this should be where we get a range of combat style. So, if we don't get it, I'm probably going to, you know, go to a different class. Uh, oh, we got another one. Yeah, yeah. I'll go stealth just for the hell of it. Why not? Uh, here we go. Combat style feat. So we do get it. So two-handed weapon. Oh, menacing. Oh, that's really good because you can get cornergon strike earlier. Oh, okay. Cleave power. So I've already got power attack. Intimidating prowess. Yeah, I'm gonna go menacing. Dazzling display. Yeah, I'm just going to go intimidating prowess for the moment. Cool. Yes, alright. That's cool as hell. Uh, Why am I getting so many skill points? Oh, that's... Perception. Okay, that's weird. Anyway. Uh, combat reflexes. Let's grab that. Favoured terrain. The ground. Urban. Let's go urban for now. All right, so what is going on here? Huh? Okay. I balked this. No, no. Now he's level six. What the fuck? Okay. Uh, what? And he's back to improve. Yeah. Okay. I think we're just gonna go back here. Except 
Oh oh. What have I done? Barrels of using mods. I might have fucked it. Should be able to go back to my old save even if I did. Let's hope. No, the lozenge. Oh man, this is taking a long time to load now. If I watch it, don't watch it, it'll go quicker. Works every time. In the meantime, I'll do some of my shitty mobile game Hero Wars. Imprisonment begins in one's own mind. Baphomet. Yeah, he's not not very nice, is he? The old Baphomet. I can see progress there. Cool.
Hmm. I think I may have crashed my game. Yep, okay. Let's do the thing. Let us... Says looking for Pathfinder. There we go. All right, start it up again. I don't remember it taking this long before. No, we're oh, fine. Okay. Load the game. Let's try to load this one again. Okay, it's not going slow like it did last time, so that looks fine. Q Q Q. All right. What's V do? Right. Hmm. My shoulders are a bit dodgy. Anyway. Uh, all right. So I haven't created this mercenary yet. So respect. Uh, what I'll do. Oh, that's actually a slider. Oh wow. Huh. All right. Anyway, could I have my dog come with me? All right, let's try and do this again. Give him some cash. Uh, custom. Where's helmet, mate? I do also one day have to um. Oh, maybe I'll use him as my witch. I was thinking about doing a witch. I'll use the fucking evil Yoda as my witch. Um, yeah, that'd be cool. Alright, where's my demon hunter Ranga? Oh, I do need a little bit of wisdom for a Ranga, don't I? Because they're going to get uh, spellcasting later. Okay, well, I probably need to work that out. But, that's fine. Um, I went with Mendeven Orphan, I think. Cool. Alright. No, I want Strength. That'll do. That looks good. I want Athletics, Persuasion, Perception. Uh... What else does he want to do? Grab that and one more. Yeah, I'll grab some stealth. Why not? Why not? Okay, now I want power attack. No. Oh, shit. Power attack. Done. And I want the Siren Ray. Cool. Uh, I 
I keep doing that? Uh, piece the headgear off. Yep. Uh, there's three. Cool. So no worthwhile beards. That one. Don't. Yep. Cool. We do it my way. I need concentration. All right. Good job. You know what? I'm just gonna make him fourth of the fourth. I'll need to review this spell later. All right. Now let's just try. Yeah. Now that I everything's working properly, hopefully I can just build him conventionally, and everything will work fine. Menacing, intimidating prowess. Uh, Ranga Demon Slayer. Nice. Um, that's right, combat reflexes. Uh, urban, sure. Alright. So he looks pretty cool, I must say. Uh, demonologist. Oh yeah. Oh, knowledge arcana. Oh. Uh, I probably should go on knowledge arcana. Oh well. That's fine. That's fine. All right. So that's one. Let's do evil Yoda. Let's do an evil Yoda. Why not? Uh. Do a witch, elemental witch, hagbound. What? Oh, no. Nah. Hell no. Nah. Uh. Ah, okay. So they become a Spontaneous caster. Without the patron. Oh, I kind of like the patron though. Well, I think it would just go regular. A regular one. Uh, now. Uh, kind of feel like a gnome or a halfling, maybe. Dex and charisma. Con and charisma. I do like weird colour hair, so fuck it. Let's just let's just go with our gnome. Uh, fire resistance. That's not bad. Oh, base speed thirty feet. Yeah, let's do that one. Uh, I imagine this was a wanderer. Yeah, let's get more hitch points. Why not? Alright, so I need good int. So that's going to be quite costly. Um, not sure I need the charisma that much. Yeah, that'll do. That'll do, that'll do. Yeah, you need knowledge arcana. World. Let's get to use magic device. Yeah, law well nature. That's fine. Uh, uh, 
Okay. Um, can't get extra hex straight away. Oh, that's shadow fire. Shadow spells. Okay. Spell penetrations. Oh, there's, there's a lot. Yeah, let's get spell penetration because so far I've been actually run into a bit of spell resistance. So uh, I think that will be good. Uh, hit points. I want it. I want an initiative bone. Is there anything else that gives me initiative? No, it looks like I've got a rabbit. I got a rabbit. Expeditious retreat, cat's grace, haste, freedom of movement. That's a pretty good list. Deception. Yeah. Divine favor, invisibility, magic vestment. I mean, yeah, nah. Endurance healing. Healing's quite good because then you've got, yeah. Lesser restoration, restoration, greater restoration, mass heal. That's that's actually pretty good because then you get your you know your arcane spells from your witch, and then you get that. Um, let's keep going though. Uh, mercy, shadow, shadow are all right. Uh, no, I'm not doing that. No, okay, so I think it's between agility and healing, probably. I mean, I'm pretty sure I can get Expeditious Retreat, Cat's Grace I don't care about, and get Haste. Can I get Freedom of Movement? That is... Yeah. I think I'll go with healing. Let's just, let's just roll with healing. Evil Eye Hex is definitely what I want. Alright, let's get Mage Person. Uh, let's get Mage Armor. Uh, hmm. There's a lot of spells. Uh, second for the spell is duration. Let's do Ray of Enfeeblement, because that basically always works. Like, you, they lose at least some strength. Um, Summon Monster. Uh, a lot of these are just a little bit trash, to be honest. Yeah, Sonic Damage is rarely resistant. Okay. Right, cool. So, there's all these extra ones here that don't appear over here. Anyway, um, let's do a little Zonku tonight. Why not? It's going to be lawful neutral, so I want full evil. Oh yeah, give me that, give me that purple hair. There we go, purple hair, baby. Hairstyle. No, I don't want that. I mean, this guy's pretty fucking ridiculous. Let's just go the full Dragon Ball Z. Fucking hair. That's assuming I'm using that correctly. I oh, look at that beard. That. Yep. Yep. That's cool. That is cool. No, he doesn't want wall paint. He does, however. Want that. He's a mad man. Um, 
Yoda. And he will be on the 13th of... What's an evil number? Nine. I don't know. Whatever. I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm not going to play this guy much because um, he sounds fucking annoying. <laughs> uh, knowledge world... That, 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 cool. I get another hex. Cackle. Cackle is so good. Ward hex. Oh, okay. That's actually pretty good. Heal is okay, but I'm, I'm going to get cackle. Cackle is just nuts. Oh, I've got two more spells? Jesus Christ. I might as well get Remove Sickness. That could be handy. Uh, snowball. Why not? Alright. We get a feat... What did I get before? Spell penetration. Not a bad call. Not a bad call. Um, let's get toughness. Yeah, let's get tough. Oh, actually, no. Let's get approved initiative. That's what we want. Here we go, now we're starting to get to those spells. We want Glitter Dust, for sure. False Life. Web. Let's get False Life. Alright, so Evil Yoda's ready to go. Is there any other characters we really want to make right now? I don't think so. Alright, so, back on with more actual gameplay. Yay. Uh, get rid of show quests. Okay, so what do we got here? Companion quests. Find Sealer's friend. Divided city. Ah, uh, Wodgeleaf. Let's go get Wodgeleaf. Wodgeleaf? Wodgeleaf? Not really. Not really sure how that's pronounced, but let's go get him anyway. We'll probably end up wanting to respec him too. Um, and that's dark. I might actually turn the brightness up a little bit. Uh, or gamma, yeah. There we go. Okay. Yes, I talked to Irabeth. Come on, Delvin. Can't be free for two years off next. I'm going free. Your schedule is set. This tiefling will freeze you for everything you've got. Mark my words. Possibly. I mean, he can't be any dodgier than the other chick I got. He's kind of a dick, though. Not gonna lie. Stand behind me and look easy, and I'll handle the rest. Somehow. That's all. I'll, I'll 
Okay. Uh, he's, he's moving slow. He's like, no, I really don't want to do this. <laughs> and, alright. He's just going to go do that. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. So is he in here somewhere? There he is. Let's go have a yarn. Mother and father had a bakery. Life was great. The gods never blessed them with any children. One day my mother went to the river to wash some clothes. Saw a basket floating. Inside was a baby, adorable and chubby and fast asleep. This was truly. In my hand was a note spritzed with expensive perfume that said, Take care of my little angel. I reckon he's lying. I'm just saying. Uh, raised me their own when I turned 15. My mother showed me my baby blanket. It was embroidered with a coat of arms of an unknown kingdom, all in gold thread. Since then, I've been looking for my real parents. But it's not easy. Travelling takes money. So if you have a few gold, I'll pay you back as soon as I find my real family. I'll give my word. Yeah. Usually, everything explains <laughs> everything I say. People love stories. <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> okay. My family's human, both my father and my mother. They used to live in a village nearby. I forget the name. Ma had me. My old man got so mad he almost killed her. He pinned her to the wall and started asking questions, like why his son had horns and a tail. Well, my ma told him that her mother, my grandma, used to fool around with a demon. When he heard this, dearest Daddy Dearest got drunk, trashed the house, then took off. Okay. Mum brought him here to Canaveras and left him with his grandma. You and your demon have ruined my life, now you handle him. Cool. And she left. <laughs> okay. All right. If you don't work, you don't eat. Ah, okay. He did the magic, so that's why he's a um Eldritch. Stalker? Eldritch Trickster? One of those. <laughs> okay. Wow. He's just betraying every motherfucker. Okay. Don't steal from the family.
All right, let's check him out. Wolgif. As the descendants of demons, tieflings are not the most respected or trusted of Mendev citizens, to put it mildly. However, a few minutes in conversation with Wolgif is enough to see that it isn't prejudice working against this particular tiefling. It's his puddle-deep personality, his membership of one of Mendev's biggest thief gangs, and his chronic inability to stick to anything, even his own principles. Wolgif sees Zeljka purely as a convenient way to solve a few of his problems, at least for now. Yep, that seems accurate. Uh, weakening wound. Oh, damage reduction ignored. That's really good. I guess that is really good. Um, what's his... What is 20 dex? Yeah, okay, con. Intelligence. Oh, I guess maybe get spells from that. Eldritch Scoundrel. Okay. Okay, well. Um, what feats did he get? Two weapon fighting and double slice. Scribe scrolls. Is that just from Eldritch Scoundrel? Uh, I mean, he seems built quite acceptably. Daggers? Probably give him, um, that short sword. Two weapon fighting, double slice. Ah, finesse trading dagger. Nah, hell nah. I don't want daggers. I want short swords or kukris. Alright, well, yeah, okay. I will rebuild him then. Just because, ah, uh, fuck, daggers. Okay. Pickpocket. So there's Pickpocket and Callistria. And regular Tiefling. Alright. Let's do that. What's the original stats? Uh, cool. Uh, Rogu, Eldritch Scandal, Scoundrel, Scandal, uh, Regular Tiefling, uh, Street Urchin, Pickpocket. I don't think I'm going to do anything to that stats block. Oh, I got 20, uh, nope, 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 nope. Uh, yeah, no extra stat. Okay, original stats, no extras. Let's do it like that. Cool. Um, rip. Eldritch scoundrel. Tiefling. 
Mr. Rich and pickpocket. Yeah, I'm just gonna leave that. Uh, now, trickery and stealth are essential. Nobility. Deception. I want to acknowledge Arcana, given that he's a bit spellcasty. Uh, okay, so. I don't know if I actually want two weapon fighting just yet. I might instead. So this is level one, so I can't get. Could get Arcane Strike. The Swift. I'm not actually familiar with Eldritch Scoundrel. Do they have. Do they get much Swift action stuff later? I don't know. Um. Okay, Deft Hands. Piranha Strike. Let's get that. Why not? Oh! Oh, he gets level 1 spells straight away. Six of them. Grease. Mage Armor. Right person. Uh, shield. Sure. True Strike. Stunning barrier. Uh, vanish. Uh, I'll get expeditious retreat. How long does that last? A minute per level. Okay. Uh, where was Calistria, I believe? Cool. Now, I want to keep that one he got. Weakening Wound, let's keep that. That was quite good, really. Oh, Jesus, more spells. Damn, these dudes get lots of spells. I did not realise they, they had that many things. Um, Eldritch Scoundrel. Wow. Corrosive Touch. Shocking Grasp. Why not? I mean, he's going to have a good deck, so I might grab a Hurricane Bow as well. Weapon focus short sword. So what do I get first? What was the first feat I got? Piranha strike. Yep. Yeah, let's just focus on hitting with our single attack first, I think, before we get two weapon fighting. Uh, short sword. Okay, and then oh, it doesn't get um, mirror image. Oh, hang on. Ah, oh, his spell progression's slower. That's where it comes in. Okay, so magic weapon, magic missile. Sure, why not? Okay. Oh, I haven't memorized any spells for her yet. Ooh, what's that? Okay. Uh, oh, we definitely want lesser restoration. 
definitely need that sickening entanglement. Yeah, it's not bad, not bad. Hold animal. Resist energy. I sort of want more mass resist energy though, really. Train. Hmm. I mean, bark skin. Let's do. Yeah, let's do bark skin. Okay, so he's got mage armor, shield. We'll do grease, and we'll do vanish. Glitter dust. Uh, let's do ones as well. That's fine. Okay. Ones for you. Burning. Oh, a burning hand there. Get out of here. Foo. Command. Remove sickness. Remove fear. The fear might be handy. You don't have spells. You don't have spells. Uh, you got level three shaman spells here. Uh, okay. Oh, that's pretty good. Spirit magic slots. So what? What have I got them going there? Just bull strength. It looks like. Okay. Let's grab false life. Protection from, oh, I mean, oh, let's grab another lesser restoration as well. So that way, once you start doing like um, scrolls and shit, that'll be handy. You don't get any spells yet. Okay, everyone's got their spells. I think we need to go have a nap to get all those spell updates in, and then I think we'll head out and start doing some shit. Available alchemy. Get rid of them. Just begin. Cool. Must have got slow saving. Oh, he's talking to Sila. Straight into the banter. Okay. Let us leave this place. Outside.
Oh. So it's just me. Okay. So the basement. Joran Vane. Let's go talk to him. Ah, blacksmith. Dresden was built after the First Crusade, back when it seemed like victory was ours for the taking, and that the demon invasion would soon be at an end. The population of old Sarkoris was thoroughly diminished, and many of them hoped to see their hard fighting repaid with a small plot of unclaimed land. Dresden was a fortress built on all our hopes, and on Mendev's ambitions, though you're not supposed to say that out loud. What a city it was, Zeljka, you can't even imagine. It was built by the finest engineers from the Five Kings Mountains. Queen Galfrey spared no expense. Dresden was meant to be the capital of the Crusade movement, a monument to its glory, and a beacon of hope for all Galarian. Heroes were drawn there to seek fame and glory, and they came from all over. Taldor, Garund, Tianza. I couldn't list them all. A relic known as the Sword of Valor was kept there, the banner that had been carried into battle by Aomede herself back when she was still human. That banner protected the city and kept the demons from teleporting inside its walls. As long as the banner was in its place, Dresden was invincible, or well, so we thought. But then the world wound suddenly expanded. The demons launched a new onslaught, and folks started saying it was time to declare the Second Crusade. Dresden was unassailable, until one young officer was tempted by a beautiful woman. She convinced him that the banner shouldn't be hanging in the city, that its rightful place was on the battlefield. She whispered honeyed words about glory and valor, and convinced him that he could be a hero as great as Aomade herself. And the poor fool believed her. He rounded up some of his hot-headed friends and carried the banner outside the city gates on an unauthorized foray. The demon slaughtered them within seconds, but for some reason the courageous link ringleader was spared. A whole army teleported into Dresden. It was a bloodbath. As you can guess, the officer was called Staunton Vane, and the women, woman turned out to be a demon, not just any demon. It was Min Minago, that foul wretch. She's given us a lot of grief here in Canabras too. Just don't ask me what I was doing while my brother was off having trysts with that beast and why I didn't save him from his own stupidity. Who would have guessed it would end like this? I failed my brother, that's the truth. I brain myself every day looking at his plight. So that's the story. Why do you have your forge here in the tavern yard? Wherever I am, that's where my forge is. Okay. Ooh, show him the sword. Do I recognize it? Of course I do. I made this with my own hands. There's my brand, see? Oh, Yaniel, things have been tough without you. But at least we've still got your sword. That's something. In battle, ordinary swords get blunted, they break, but sometimes a weapon can preserve. I don't even know how to explain it, I'm no authority on these things, but something like an echo of the deeds done with that weapon, or more like the reflection of the wielder's soul? I don't know. We'll say one thing. Take care of that sword. Yaniel may no longer be with us, but the demons will still remember why they need to turn tail and run when they see Radiance. Oh, the scabbard's all worn. Can't be having a fine sword like this being carried around in this tatty thing. I'll make you a new one if you like. 
If the city sounds strong and we both survive, come see me again and I'll have it ready. No charge. Alright, show me your stuff, mate. Uh, price in descending order. Smasher. Plus two necrotic earthbreaker. Hmm. Detainer. Hmm. Living Ram. Never aware of this plus one breastplate. Uses the c charge combat maneuver and hits an enemy. They may deal they deal an additional D6 bludgeoning damage. And the enemy has to pass a reflex saving throw or become prone. That's really good. That is really, really good. Wow. Merry go round. Attrition dagger. Oh. Wow. Con damage. Nasty. Falcata. Plus two bonus on attack rolls for all touch attacks. That'd be really cool on like a Magus. Man, they've got a lot of cool fucking weapons here. Light crossbow of force. That's only when it confirms a critical hit. Okay. Acrid sickle. Butcher of undead. Roaring hand axe. Devastating blow from above. Ah, mounted. Okay. Rugged helmet. DR3 melee, but bad perception. Should be okay. Hit. Ah, affected with the effect of a mirror image spell. Hmm. That one's nice too. Sneak attacks, bastard sword, beta mail. Cold iron, masterwork, short sword. I should probably get one of them for him. Well, I can do that later once he's actually got the. Um, Yeah, right. So he's basically got pretty well every sort of weapon. And probably the same for... Armour. Okay. Bulk selling. Okay. Oh, there's a light shield. Let's grab that. Alright, so take you, and I might grab you for now. Just to round out the party. Okay. Okay, so this is different. Alright, let's see. What? Gloom family, the last chapter to complete. Okay, so I've got to do that this chapter. Wardstone Legacy. I feel like I want to do sort of side questy stuff more. Um. Market Square. Is there anywhere I've got multiple? Okay, Alessa. Oh! Oh, isn't K. Lessa one of the tieflings in Kingmaker? Oh, that's where I remembered it. I'm pretty sure it is, yeah. Okay.
Okay. Most unlikely. Gather allies for the attack on the Grey Garrison. So I need to get more allies. Blackling Library. Scout out the tower. Paulus of Mansionite. Well, let's go to Market Square first, I think. see oh there's a the rents and stuff oh okay all right well all right let's go let's let's do this one first then so I suspect that one's gonna give us more of a fallen horse no let's keep going oh Okay. Land, Baphomet Cultus, Baphomet Cultus. All right. Yeah, just shoot. Uh, Zelchka, get a charge in. Camellia, so that one. Let's, let's, let's hex to hit that one. And you, oh, well I can go just walk over and heave. Cool. Oh, again! Every fucking time they hit me, it's a crit. That's such bullshit. Uh, okay, so you. Um, you need charge in your menu. Alright, so you... Oh, hang on, I haven't actually equipped that dude. He's meant to have this. There we go. Alright. Oh. Okay, well, that'll do you then. Um... Cover me, all right. Oh, snap. All right. Okay. Oh, I've got to get some more potions. Uh, masterwork glaive, masterwork glaive, coo, coo, coo. All right. <coughs> oh, another masterwork glaive. Cool, cool, cool. All right, let's go in here.
Tasty stickers, man. Ooh. Mm, okay. Oh, I reckon it's none of them. Here's day, Sister Donna was on lookout, Brother Maroon had the scroll, Doffy, Tavi and Vani had bought the sacks, they covered the windows and lit the torches, I remember scooping up rings and tossing them in a sack, and one right expensive one rolled away from me, I crawled under a table after it, and next thing I know, Irabeth was there, everybody scampered, but I was still under the table, not my finest moment, I was going to wait it out, but then those blockheads were dragging me out by my tail and put me in shackles, they took all my rings off me, about 20,000 worth. If Dad didn't solve to injury, I never even found the last one. In the end, I got busted over nothing. It was an amulet. He used to sit in a little cushion in the window. Sterling silver. Old man Philemon was so proud of that amulet. He used to say, I'll never sell it. It's the jewel of my collection. I used to go there to see what kinds of treasures there were in the world. There's nothing else to look at in Canabras. People used to claim it was a powerful thing, but who's to say? If you ever stole a thing like that, you'd have the guards on you the second you tried to fence it. We have ourselves a mystery. Okay.
Huh. Okay, well. We're going. Hmm. Alright, so. Back here it is. Two hours. Sure. In we go. Come on, doggo. Uh, you're best up here. Hmm, he had a cloak with a hood masking his face, but the horns, the long horns, didn't fit under it. There should be a guardian golem in ancient trees and wonders. The shop they tried to rob, the owner gave us the construct's code word just in case. The golem itself was destroyed, but their head seems to be intact, so you can interrogate the thing and find out what it saw. Code word is Hand of Arori. The shop's owner must have escaped, but there's a good chance you get lucky with a golem. It's also a fucking magic shop, so there might be fat loots. Alright, let's go do that. Okay. Let's go there for shiggles. And let's go there. Save the last one for me. Oh. Sure. Okay, so Sila, charge on in, mate. Get rid of that. Shield bash. Yeah, alright. Charge. Watch lift. Oh, he's, uh. I should have charged him anyway. Mess with its AC. Alright, you go chomp him down. For some reason, I'm getting an extra hit. I mean, that's fine. Oh. I didn't actually give him that, so... Oh. Jesus. Okay. Alright, now. You... Grab that. And piss that off. 
Okay. All right. Cool. Oh, I'll have to check my formation as well. All right, continue. Ah, oh, because you got to get across there. Right. That makes sense. Now, I imagine there's some demons and shit in here or something. Alright, what was our formation? So, Sila at the front. Old mate there. She can go back. You go there. Uh, you go there. That looks like it'll work. Hello? Is anyone there? Please, get me out of here. Finian, the talking... Oh, cool. Phew, free at last. I thought I'd be flattened. Ah, oh, look, mate. I thought I'd be flattened like a pancake under that rubble. Much obliged. Damn, I'm not in any pain, but my head is still foggy for some reason. What's with all the hubbub in the city? The name's Finian. I'm a pathfinder. If there's anything I can do to help, I will. You're a Pathfinder? That's right, Finian Dismar, Pathfinder and Crusader. I roam around the world wound wherever my tasks lead me, scouting mostly. But this last while I've just been hanging around in Canabras, waited until I'm needed again. I'm bored out of my mind, but at least this shop makes for better lodging than some inn. What I meant was, what are you? What's that supposed to mean? I just told you. You want to know where I hail from, is that it? Well, I'm from around here, actually. We Kellards of the Star Eye Clan fled when the world wound troubles began, but I couldn't stand by while the demons wreaked havoc, so I came back. Or did you mean to ask about my weapon of choice? My best weapon is every weapon. I'm a skilled and capable fellow, if I do say so myself. I can swing a sword and poke with a spear, but what I'm best at is communing with the spirits. They call folks like me Phantom Blades. Phantom Blade, what's that? It's like a spiritualist, but with a twist. It means that some spirit took a liking to me at some point, and it can turn into whatever weapon I need. Handy, eh? I don't need any whetstones or enchantments. Doesn't take up space, either. Although, to be fair, it's not a barrel of laughs. The spirits that bestow this kind of power don't come from happy places, and they're not exactly bright-eyed and bushy-tailed. They usually appear after great battles that leave few survivors. The city's under attack by demons. Wait, what? The last thing I saw was some thieves breaking in here. Then the guards came, everyone was running around. After that, it was a bit of a blur. Right when things got intense, they dropped the cabinet on me. I couldn't even help the owner. I was just lying under the shelves like a dimwit until you came along. If there are demons in Canabras, we must do something about it. The city needs every blade it can get. Hey, do you mind taking me with you? I don't think I can handle this alone. Besides, the more the merrier. How'd you end up in this shop? Yeah, I've been here so long I don't even remember anymore. Just sitting and waiting for any word from the Pathfinders. It looks like everyone has forgotten about me. The shop owner is an old friend of the Pathfinders, so I've taken up residence here. Alright, I'll take you with me. Finian. What? What? Finian. Oh. Uh, okay.
turned on ghost touch okay I'm cool with that very cool with that what's this very glad I came here oh. some scrolls have been torn apart and some have been trotted on by muddy boots demonic heart okay it's a little macabre Polished oak shells once showcased magic rings and amulets. Now it's all of grubby handprints of robbers. Okay. Unique weapons and antique armor. Okay. Formerly one of the shows has been completely ransacked, lying in the corner next to a scorched wall of soot covered shards of a clay golem's head. Golem's eyes go in the gloom. Master, code word. Hand of Aurori, awaiting orders. This golem was created by Gaffrin and Son and Son. Address their building on the right, Jewelers Alley, Nerosian, Mendev, model G504NE, which stands for Experimental and Enhanced. For all inquiries, contact Mr. Gaffrin. 56 individuals entered the shop, human, female, old. Known female, old, human, female. For any of the suspicious people. Tieflings, three. Tiefling male, middle aged. Tiefling male, young. Tiefling female, young. Let's go with the young male. Medium height, short corns, curling backward. Medium length tail, eye color yellow, hair color black. Special observations, annoyed master. Yep, that's him. <coughs> Middle-aged male, medium height, ooh, long horns, medium length tail, eye color pale blue, skin color dark, special observations, red hair, Above average height, hair long, pale, tail not observed, long horns, eye colour, blue, special observation, scar on nose, baldric with gold stitching. Philemon Frulia Trust, my master, is in his hiding place. Revealing the location of the hiding place is prohibited, prohibited, prohibited. The basement is below me. I guard the basement. Leaving my post is prohibited. Ah, okay. Well, let's go get the rest of this stuff over here. Loot. Loot. Pipe Fox. Summons a Pipe Fox familiar. Pers knowledge Arcana and Perception. Well, that's pretty cool. Counterfeit. Oh, wow. Counterfeit jewelry. Very well. All right, let's try and get down there. Athletics. Came here to tell me. Don't 
reached out to make it look like I'd left. What? Watch was very keen to get their hands on those tieflings. They seem to be multiplying all over Galarian. So of course I did everything they said and I've been stuck in this basement ever since. The golem wouldn't move away from the door no matter how much I yelled at it. But then I thought that it was all to the good. Somebody came up by after the guards and caused a ruckus upstairs, bellowing like mad, taking advantage of my absence. Guard an eager watch. Ooh. All right. So I haven't got thieflings. I thought the city's finest one would job. You can't run in and ask your questions when it's important. So yeah, watch this. Been skulking around my shop for years, treating the place like a free museum. He always wanted to look at the moon and the abyss. I'd chase him out, but he'd just slink back in again. If he was with the gang that robbed my shop, I'd bet anything he swiped the moon. How come I'm the prime suspect? Tell me about the red-haired tiefling. Yes, there was one who came in, spent a long time looking around. He was a person of modest means, I could tell by his clothes, but he asked him me to show him an Asimar-made chainmail. He certainly couldn't afford it. That's when I suspected that something was off. I checked everything after he left, but nothing was missing, and that put my m mind at ease. I can't remember what he's looking like. I didn't get a good look at his face. All I remember is he wrapped in a green cloak like he was freezing. Ah, well, tell me about the tiefling woman. Ah, oh yes, I'm now a noble lady, unlike the tiefling ruffings we have around here. She purchased magical equipment for the crusade. She promised to come again. Okay. So we apparently... Oh, he's got grog. Oh, I'll leave him to his wine. I'm not going to pinch his wine on him. All the poor little fellas got. Upstairs. Uh, okay. Out we go. We're good. Alright, what I might do is allocate these, um, oh, um, these fancy little things to knowledge arcana. Leaf. Uh, and this one, what's that one do? Perception and law nature. Yep, so you can get them. Back to the tiefling hideout, less than an hour. Bam, straight in there. Cool. Melrune. Melrune, I say. Green cloak. Tiefling with long horns. Yeah, it's Melrune. Look. Green cloak, red hair, long horns.
shanked. Grab him. Take him away for questioning. Could have got away with it if it wasn't for you little kids. Someone connected to the cult of Baphomet ordered him to steal the moon of the abyss, and the best idea he could come up with was to drag us into it. He got the scroll to take out the golem. He betrayed us to Erebus so that he could swipe the emblem in the chaos. He thought we'd get nicked and he'd slink off to meet up with his customer. He said when he got to the window, display the moon was gone. He had time to hand the moon off to the person who ordered it. Bloody cultus. Okay. Okay. Let's see if we can get him a better apology. Yes! Oh, now I'm just apparently pushing it. Oh, cool. I'll go down the vault. Oh, okay. Uh, oh, there we go. Don't I have the key? What? Didn't I just get given a key? The fuck you say? Opens a vault with a small brass key. So why? There we go. Oh, there's a trap. Oh, hang on. Oh. Uh, okay. Rawr. Disables the trap. Okay. Fat loots. Oh, there's a secret door too. Oh, ring a ning ning. Ring of sharp strike. Shoots an enemy and hits oh that's fucking cool that's very cool that is a nice item you know nothing fucking amazing or anything but just nice I'll give that to cuckoo oh it's not a magic cuckoo I thought it was a magic cuckoo for a sec I'll still grab it because I don't have any cuckoos 100 loot oh here we go two things at count book Alright, so that cool fucking item's gonna go on LAN. Because that item is very fucking cool. I don't see me using that right through, to be honest. Leave. Okay. All right, let's go to the marketplace. Blackwing Library. Yeah, so everyone's everything's going to go through Market Square anyway. 
So, yeah, let's, let's go there. Journey will take three hours. Um, I've been streaming for a couple of hours now, so we might, um, oh, what's going on there? Talk to Wolji. Okay. I'll do this one. This is my time to work. Okay, let's just Oh, here we go. Zelchka. Mother's Crusader, Dretch. Oh, yeah. Okay, so who's going to be first? The Crusader. Alright. So, I'm not... Alright. If that's the case... Ten minutes per level. Let's, let's do that on myself. Alright. Let's go. Bam! Yeah, I don't care, mate. Uh, so it's still... So I'll get sneak attack. Cover me, all right. Oh. Oh, it's too... De oh, these are... Oh, these are my peeps. Oh, okay. I didn't realize that. Alright, uh, so I'm going to make your to hit roll worse, buddy. Because you probably got too much health to outright kill. Oh, 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 I smashed him over there somewhere. What the fuck? <laughs> oh, that was ridiculous. Buy him a little monarchy. Okay, you can just stop because. Yeah. The 
passion for me. It's messy as AC up to make him easier to finish off. Okay. Let's talk to him. Okay. Yeah, why not? Let's try and go there. Oh. Actually, I might just end stream there. Go get some lunch.